Well, I never was very good any student. How long are you here for? Well, I don't know yet. You gonna, you gonna shack up here? I thought I would if it's not inconvenient for you all. Yeah. Traveling wears me off. Well, take it easy. Ah, oh, those cats. Hey, Stella! What'd you, what'd you do, fall asleep in there? Huh? Well, I guess I'm gonna strike you as being the unrefined type, huh? You know, Stella spoke a good deal about you. Uh, she said you were married once, weren't you? Yes. Well, I was quite young. Is that what happened? Is that what happened? The boy. The boy died. Rita. Boy, to be sick. Uh, well, looks like she's fixing to stay a while. Yeah. Hey, Sash, we playing tonight? Yeah. Well, I figured maybe we. No, 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 listen, no, figure no, maybe it's a little bit the same. Put it down. All right. Now, I'll go get the other one. Yes. Thanks, darling. Stella? Yes? Is that Stanley back with my trunk? Yes, Blanche. Honey, will you get my little blue net out for me? The quieter news. She's terribly upset. Over what? She's been through such an ordeal. We lost Bill Reeve. What is the, what is the place in the country? Uh -huh. Well, how? Why, well, it had to be sacrificed or something. Honey, look, when she comes in, be sure and say something nice about her appearance. And oh, don't mention the baby. I haven't said anything yet. I'm waiting until she gets in okay. a quieter condition. And try to understand and be nice right. to her, honey. She wasn't expecting to find us in such a place. Uh -huh. See, I tried to gloss things over a little in my letters. I admire dress, tell her she's looking wonderful. It's important to Blanche, a little weakness. Okay, I mean, I get the idea, but... I mean, now let's just skip back a little. The way you said the place was disposed of. Oh, yeah. Well, honey, how about a few more details on that subject? Honey, look, it's best not to talk much about it until she's calmed down. Well, now, is that going to be the deal? The Sister Blanche can't be annoyed with the tales right now? Well, you saw how she was last night. Well, I saw how she was. Now, let's, I mean, let's cop a gander at the bill of sale. I haven't seen any. What do you mean? She didn't show you no papers, no deed of sale, no nothing like that? It seemed like it wasn't so. Well, then what was it then? Give away the charity? Shh, hear you. Oh, I don't care if she hears me. Now, let's see the papers. Honey, there weren't any papers. She didn't show any papers. I don't care about papers. Look, wait. Now, listen. Did you ever hear of the Napoleonic Code, though? No, Stanley. I haven't heard of the Napoleonic Code. All right, Code, okay. Then just, I... No, now, just let me enlighten you on a point or two. Yes? Now, we got here in the state of Louisiana what's known as the Napoleonic Code. You see, now, according to which that what belongs to the wife belongs to the husband also and vice versa. Fine feathers and furs, and she comes to bring herself in here. What is this article? That's a solid gold dress, I believe. Oh, honest. And this one here. And what, what is that? Fox piece? Stan. That's genuine fur fox a half a mile long. Where, where are your fox pieces? Those, this is bushy snow white ones, no less. Where are your white fox furs? Those are inexpensive summer furs that Blanche has had a long time. Listen, I have an acquaintance who deals in this sort of merchandise, and he's coming in here and making an appraisal of this. Oh, don't be such an idiot, Stanley. Listen, I, I'm going to bet you a thousand dollars invested in this stuff. Well, all right. Now, what is that? There's a treasure chest of a pirate. Oh, Stanley! That's pearl, Stella. Ropes of them. What is this, sister? Is a deep-sea diver? Bracelet, solid gold. Where are your pearls and gold bracelets? Oh, still, Stanley. And here you are, diamonds, a crown for an empress. A rhinestone tiara she wore to a costume ball. What is, uh, what is rhinestone? Next. Oh, Stanley. 
here I am, all freshly bathed and fed and feeling like a brand new human being. Oh, that's good. Will you, uh, excuse me while I put on my pretty new dress? 